In October of 2018, JCPS implemented a plan to hire and retain more black teachers, and since then they've hired 35 more, but the superintendent says there is still work to do. Right now, 24% of JCPS teachers are black. Superintendent Marty Polio said Wednesday morning that it's an increase from where they were two years ago, but the goal is to have the JCPS teaching staff better reflect the student population, which consists of 36% black students. These are the steps that have to happen to address the achievement gap. It's a gap only more exposed during the online learning this year. Dr. Polio says that gap has not gotten better for black students in 30 years, but it's been a deeper focus for JCPS since 2018. The district restructured its human resources recruitment and retainment efforts. They also partnered with Louisville HBCU Simmons College and UofL for teacher pipeline programs. Get this, Polio says national research shows students who have two black teachers are 32 percent more likely to attend attend college. We need more of you if you're out there. Andrea Wynn says she's proof representation matters in education. For me personally, uh, I didn't have a a black science teacher at all until college. Wynn was actually working as a JCPS substitute recently while working towards a career in medicine, but she saw a new career path that she wanted to take. She says the resources, like being paired with an experienced teacher during her first year, led her to become a seventh grade science teacher at Stewart Academy. It's just important to see more teachers that look like me, ones with curly hair, ones um, with the same skin tone. But both Wynn and Polio told me benefits of teachers of color impact white students too. They may learn new historical or cultural perspectives. Wynn says if you're thinking about a possible career change, consider JCPS. Especially if you're in the STEM field, please come join us, see what it's like, because um, I really think once you get here, you'll want to stay. Marvis Herring, WLKY News.